International operator, please. Yes, ma'am. I want to place an international call for North Ireland. The number is four four zero eight four six six eight three one one one. What city is it? Uh, it's uh, it's in around Belfast. It's the main prison there. It's Ireland. Yes, ma'am. North Ireland. North Ireland. Let me just check on it. Uh, I need to speak to Carol McPeak, please. Who's calling? Uh, Vernon Oxford calling for Wilfie Cummings. Hello. Uh, Miss McPeak? That's right. This is Vernon Oxford calling from uh, Franklin, Tennessee. How are you? Hello, Vernon. I have Wilfie sitting about two feet from me. Good. Well, praise the Lord. Uh, morning. Uh, just fine. Everything's all right here except it's mighty dry. Yeah, we have a drought going on. We're supposed to run out of water in about two weeks. I just wanted to see how Wilfie was doing. How, how's Wilfie? Hi, hi, he's sitting here. Okay. I come let you speak to him. But I'll be relaying the message. All right. I'll just ask him uh, how, how he is. Okay, he says. Vernon, he says that there is a drought on over here, but it's a drought of country music. Oh, well, great. Uh, I wish I had more of it, but uh, I'm just a little too country for some of the things over here. Uh, tell him that I'm coming over on a tour, a uh, country music tour. I'll be leaving here Friday, the 8th of July. Yes. Tell him I look forward to the Monday that I can sit there and look at his big old rugby face. <laughs> He says that you and he are going to take the Grand Old Opry by storm. All right, that's the deal. All right, that's the deal. He said that the people at the prison, a lot of the prison officers here are asking for you. Well, great. Tell, uh, tell Wilfie to relay a great big old uh, country howdy for me. Hello, Wilfie. Hello, Wilfie. Hello, Wilfie. Hello, Wilfie. Hello, Wilfie. Hello, Wilfie. Hello,
Well, I guess I better get off here. Okay, Vernon. He said thanks very much, most of all, for being his friend. Oh, all right. Thank you. Tell him I said God bless him. God bless you. Bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Well, I had my first thing. My name is Junior Lee Farrell, and I was born and raised here in Nashville, Tennessee. I met Vernon when I was about, uh, <laughs> I'd say I was about 17 years old. Vernon come down at Mom's place on McGowan Street, and uh, I was trying to learn how to sing. I couldn't carry a tune in the bucket. So Vernon was the leader of the band. So little Leo wrote the song for Vernon called Little Sister Put Your Shoes Away. I told Vernon, said, we got a guy over there that uh, wants to sing. Vernon looked over and he said, well, can he sing? Well, I said, well, I'd try. He said, no, can you sing? Well, I tell you what to do. He said, we'll harmonize on the song all us together. If you care a good tune, then you can sing. If you don't, it's... Well, believe me, he did that. Vernon was a simple guy. He... He didn't think he's no big shot, and he loved Hank Williams so well, but the people out on Music City Road got the wrong idea, and they put a clamper on him on the counter, they say he was trying to copy Hank Williams. So Vernon got disgusted, and he quit the music business for a long time. I believe he figured, well, if I can't sing the man I love, then I'm going to quit. Well. We all got to talking to him. I said, I said, I said, Bernie, oh, Bernie, you got it, man. No. He said, I, I'm not going to do it. He said, I quit. And that's the last time I seen him. And so you told me where he was at. Well, an angel is on. He did. I bet it's a keeper, don't you? Can you get in it? <laughs> but not my, put your shirt in your pants, honey. We're getting close to church. Davey? What? Won't you boys to be real good out here today now? Okay. Show them what a little man you can be. Yeah, and if you want another G.I. Joe, you better stand up during the service. That's right. Not go to sleep. Insane. Don't that's sit there like you. That's right. Oh, I sure hope this is good out here this morning. I do too. Hope there's a lot of people here. We'll be in the 4th of July weekend. It? Well, yeah, we're new. We're due for we're a new band. We're about here, Mama. We're at church, Mama. Mm-hmm. It'd be a good Sunday today. Yeah. The Lord's going to be there this morning. It'd be a good service. Good, good minute. in Ireland. So we want to pray for this country and we want to pray for our brothers as we send him in. Father, in the name of Jesus, as we lay hands on our brother, Father, we'd ask that your anointing would rise up upon him in the name of Jesus. Father, we send him forth as a love ambassador of the Lord, of the Lord Jesus. 
As a love ambassador of the United States, Father, as a love ambassador of Franklin, Tennessee, we send him forth to the country of Ireland. Father, that country that is so torn right now with strife. Father, where people are not loving one another as they should. And Father, where they don't trust one another. Father, we pray that the signs and the wonders of God will follow him and accompany him. Thank you for the vision that he has. Thank you, thank you for the, for the open door that you've given him to go. To share his music and to share his life in Jesus' name. Father, we thank you for blessing our Father, in the name of Jesus. We thank you for blessing those people and preparing their hearts, even now while we speak in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Let's give the Lord a hand. and some goodness and some kindness. 